TRIED, CONVICTED, AND SENTENCED IN JUST HOURS. AN OMAHA MAN WILL GO TO PRISON FOR LIFE FOR THE LIFE HE TOOK IN A JEWELRY STORE. GOOD EVENING. I'M ROB MCCARTNEY. AND I'M BRANDY PETERSON. MILTON DORCH, JUST 19 YEARS OLD, CONVICTED OF FIRST-DEGREE MURDER FOR SHOOTING AND KILLING STORE OWNER JAMES MINSHAW NEARLY ONE YEAR AGO. KETV NEWS WATCH 7'S CHRISTINA ENGDAHL WAS IN COURT FOR TODAY'S BIG STORY. And Brandy, one detective in the case saying he doesn't remember every step of the process happening in one day like this, and he also expressed relief that this part is finally over for the Minshaw family. Now, I also did talk to the Minshaw family today who say that they're relieved too, and they say they're thankful for the outcome. It's the moment the Minshaw family changed forever. A security camera is rolling as Milton Dorch walks into JR Jewelry with a gun drawn. Dorch even took the stand in his own defense, saying his intention was to rob JR Jewelry. Instead, he ended up committing murder, killing the store's owner and a family man, James Minshaw Sr. Took me right back to September 17th. But having to hear Jimmy yell for dad, and dad never answered back. Milton Dorch testified that at gunpoint, he ordered staff to hand over jewelry. Minshall stepped to the back, retrieving a gun from the safe. At that moment, Dorch says he got scared and thought, quote, it's done and over with. I don't want to do this anymore. His attorney, Glenn Shapiro, asked, why didn't you just turn and leave? Dorch's response, quote, if I ran off, he would have shot me in my back. You know, that was nonsense. It was ludicrous. I mean, it's... He's the person that introduced the deadly force into the equation here. Klein also confronted Dorch about his confession, where Dorch reportedly said, quote, it was him or me. Dorch doesn't dispute pulling the trigger, but he says he didn't intend to harm anyone. Quote, I was going in there to get jewelry, not to kill. He could have turned and ran. There was no reason for him to fire. He didn't accidentally fire three times. He knew what he was doing when he pulled the trigger. Minshall's family, who saw the shooting and frantically tried to save his life, also took the stand, identifying Dorch as the shooter. And when Dorch's attorney asked if he physically took anything from the store, Minshall's son Jim Jr. replied, quote, Just my dad's life. Now, the rest of Dorch's life will be spent behind bars. It makes us feel better knowing that he can't do this to anybody else. That nobody else has to go through this. The prosecutors point out that while Minshall did retrieve a gun from the back room, he never actually fired it. Now, neither Dorch nor his attorney had any comment for us today, but Dorch did testify that he sent a letter to the Minshall family. Now, he's been sentenced to life in prison without parole, and as for the Minshall family, they tell me they'll continue to run JR's jewelry and carry on James Minshall Sr.'s legacy. Reporting live in downtown Omaha, Christina Engdahl, KETV News Watch 7.